matters uh, or at least like names don't matter and your something else is going to be your label for who you are it's gonna need a warfare for sure yeah <laughs> And, yeah. Yeah, no, and... I got a lot of concepts when I... I started thinking about this a couple of months ago, and a lot of concepts that I'm, that I'm getting into my head now that we're talking about it is coming back to that podcast I listened to, so I'm going to share it with you guys because it's super interesting. He talks, he talks about creating digital nation-states. And uh, if you get enough people together, and, and like he actually said, like yeah, Discord could be a viable option to kickstart this. He said, like, if you get enough people into a Discord group and they have the same ideas and they, they're smart people and they all use synonyms, then you could probably generate enough power to eventually buy a fucking piece of land on the desert and become a nation state, and then do everything online. That is how 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 like incredibly vo um, dynamic and. Um, fruitful that our digital uh, world is right now. Yes. Yeah. Well, yeah, but I have access to classified government documents because I am a service desk employee of the municipality of a small town. So everywhere, that's always going to be a risk. Uh, I'm just going to, so Jojo, just to like tie back before we go to metaversity, um, I guess like when we talk about like privacy, um, generally speaking, like I, I care about like political privacy or like being able to like talk right without like like being you know too much like under scrutiny right um i guess like in terms of like the hierarchy of privacy um i don't really care about transactions like what like my bank is seeing that i'm buying right i really don't care about that um mainly just because i guess like i don't know what i would be buying that's sketchy that's like <laughs> for like political uprest you know because that's pretty sketchy territory i'm not gonna lie dude like what are you buying um but <laughs> fuck my friends that's interesting because I would be I would be afraid of that. Oh, yeah, sorry, yeah, my headphones died. Um, yeah, I guess like if for me, like obviously, like privacy in terms of like free, like in terms of speech, like you know, and that kind of stuff. But I don't really care about like buying physical things like completely privately. You know, right? Like running it through banks, like that's like kind of on the lower scale of stuff. But I guess I'd like be interested in JoJo's like I guess take on that if he agrees or not. Um. Well, just imagine how freeing it would be, uh, to not have the thought in your ba in the back of your head that that information could ever be used against you, even if it's not hostile in any way, shape, or form. Yeah, I want to be able to say my racist terms. Can fuck with you with that information. And that doesn't have to be an individual. That could be a nation state. Look at um, <clears throat> Julian Assange. Anything he does is 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 completely taken under a magnifying glass and zoomed in. Kanye the West. Fullest detail. And <laughs> no moves. Same yeah, goes no, for I... Snowden at the moment. I think. You know, uh, I think freedom of speech point. is very powerful, but our governments and like. The, the countries and, you know, unions and everything that we live within provide us a lot uh, in other areas. You know, uh, freedom of speech and, like, freedom of, uh, I, like, uh, not being, you know, surveillance at all. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's, I think it's a big thing. And I, you know, every, everyone wants more of it, but I think if you're going to, like, uh, detach from the rest of the world and create like a nation that is built upon these uh you know these commandments uh i think you're probably sacrificing a lot in other 
places, but I guess that's like growing pains right now, of a new of a new are. nation. Yeah. As of right now, you are right. As if you decide to say fuck the system <laughs> yeah. and uh, join the Discord and, server. <laughs> join, the Disc well, join the Discord server. Join the digital economy and yeah. hedge your bets against uh, the fiat currency system or anything else. Right? You say literally fuck uh, democracy in its current state and yeah. you 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 also stop. Um, you stop participating in it. That's you detach, corrupts. yeah. You, you stop participating in the system. Then you're going to have a worse standard of living. Probably. Just because of that fact. And that is something that is kind of against my principles, I guess. I don't I don't see that as a humane thing. Mm -hmm. But it is how it is right now. And maybe it's good because you also need some form of order. At least we needed that back in the day. Yeah. And but I think we could grow out of it. That's what I'm saying. Is I think it's like the growing pains of the system. Like it's gonna yeah. eventually probably smooth it, out. It's probably going to be revolutionized in some form of another. Uh, yeah, in the in the near future. Mm -hmm. uh, Jojo, would you um do? I guess like I guess from like my point of view, like when I'm talking about like okay, I don't mind them like tracking like um like bank statements or like bank like transactions and stuff and like you said like we do need to have like a level of security where like we don't want the government having everything because like if they lose it and like we've seen them fuck up right where it like falls into the hands we don't want it to fall into mm -hmm. um but i guess like if you were to like if we were to look at studies or something and we would just see that like i don't know tracking like bank documents or try like transactions like incre increase like you know your country security or yeah let's say your country security like significantly like this was a massive help in like improving security or you know to anti whatever you want to call it um would you kind of take like a relative approach to that where you say okay if like the statistics show like this helps a lot and this helps curve like threats and stuff like that then you're okay with it um or would you say like it's you you would never really want it even if it like has a good chance of like i guess like reducing like heavy you know yeah, I would never really want it, because if you take that 50 years into the future, then the generation that built it has forgotten how it, uh, why exactly it was made, and then a lot there, the, that system becomes a lot more prone to corruption, because they're, they're going, there's going to be what they call copying errors, where people are put in place to take care of it, but they don't really know how it works or what it does, and then it's going to be manipulated. If, if the incentive to manipulate and deceive is not removed by making everything completely private, then it's always going to be prone to corruption. That's what I think. Okay. Check that Suki though, damn! Let yeah, me. I saw that, that was fucking nuts, kid. Oh! The double firsties? Oh, oh my. I'm gaming. <laughs> I was like halfway paying attention. Something about go something about school. like the second generation of the new order not understanding how it was built. Corruption. Well, that this is currently what's happening with the fiat currency system. I think mm -hmm. we made it as a way to replace um, our currency based on the gold standard, and we started basing it on other currencies. Thin air. I don't really know yet. It, it's pretty broken. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, but apparently it was a better system, and some guy called Keynes fucking de developed the the principles of it. But it, it basically it has a lot of holes, and it's not. It's like not our current a economy, a current yeah. like oh, yeah. I mean, it is it is just like based on the belief that you can buy stuff is like it all is, of it, right? It is it's based on the belief that that your money holds value, and yeah. Um, the the thing is, if there is no scarcity whether artificial or natural or self-emerging then it is hard to peg a value to it and exactly if they are making monetary policies that as they're doing right now and choices as they're doing right now and it's clearly a copying error and it is clearly not what the system was designed to be yeah if you print 50 percent of a money supply in all of europe in two years while the other 50% was created very gradually over 50 years, then you're doing something wrong. Shouldn't, like, optimally, shouldn't a currency uh, mimic 
the trends of the population. So, like, population growth and decline. So that... It all ties back into each other. An economy should mimic perfect input and output. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, Jojo, with... I'd be, um... Mm -hmm. I'd be interested. I got a guy who, um, got really into fiat currency and, like, cryptocurrency recently. <laughs> um, but he's kind of on, like, the other end of the spectrum <laughs> as you. Um... Would you be interested in having a conversation with them at some point? I think it'd be kind of interesting to like see you guys set up the podcast, yeah. set it up, I would really, I'd be, set up I'd be, the pod. I'd be, I'd, be, I'd be really interested. Post it on YouTube, like, Jojo. Like I don't know too much about it, but I'd be like really interested. Also, in I just want to say, Roboto, that's a really funny joke. Like on the side is like, yeah, I know this guy who got really into fiat currency. He's just flexing his hundred dollar bills. No, he's, like, really into, like, <laughs> he's just he really into his thing. money. Even to collecting that bread. To, like, get into like 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 the dynamics, like what it actually like means and stuff. Yeah. Um, so like yeah, I I'd just be interested to kind of see like how that would work. Yes, I am interested, but I'm not confident in my uh, in my knowledge. Yeah, no, like I like to me like I, I just kind of want to see because I'm always interested in learning from it, but like it's kind of hard like when I have like two ends that I can't really connect, you know. Yeah. Like, I kind of agree with both sides, I kind of just want to, I don't want to, like, divide it out, I just kind of want to interest it to, like, kind of get the viewpoints on it. Sure, I think it's good that you have multiple views on it anyway. Real I have a secondary quest. I have a secondary quest from Mystic, I gotta ask you, would you rather, because I'm gonna ask you one and I know you love them. Oh, okay, let's go. So, I'll give you a 100% chance of getting two million dollars. Yeah. Oh, 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 you can have in crypto, I guess, now after the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> okay, long-term bet. Or an 85% chance at getting 25 million. 85% chance of 25 million. Or 100%. That's a crazy... No, 85%. Yeah, 85%, 100%. <laughs> that's the... That's, right that's... I'm definitely taking the 85%. You take the same thing, Pat. I don't even know. Uh, say again. Eighty-five percent chance. I've just been working here. Two million percent chance. You broke up for a second. Say again. Yeah. Uh, twenty-five million, eighty-five percent chance, or a hundred percent chance for two million. Uh, hundred percent chance for two million. I guess I'm just, I live more on the edge than parents. He's a gambler, he's a serious uh, I'm gambler. a gambler at heart. <laughs> uh, That's crazy then, odds. You never get odds like that anywhere else, man. <laughs> That's really good odds. So, the way I, I see it, like, 85 million? Wait, is it? No, 25 million. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, like, I, I, don't, I don't see the opportunity cost of losing uh, a potential 23 million more as outweighing the the opportunity cost of like not getting anything at all at a 15% chance true so i think that 2 million is already a life changing amount of money yes and, and i think honestly, i think you got think the safe I bet I... I think i agree on principle uh that like if you get oh, 2 million no, no. dollars if you yeah. get 2 million dollars you are more in a position if you're smart with your money to be able to live off of that two million dollars for the rest of your life and to be able to yeah, grow I, that fortune like way easier yeah. you don't need the 25 mil to be able to do that you just need the two and so and yeah so and yeah, so yeah the extra 23 million would just make life easier but i don't want life to be too easy because then what am i going to do for the rest of my life true. it's like I think fun. I yeah, think right? that's more I think that's more of an existential problem than <laughs> yeah 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 and I think and I think the other factor of why you would choose the the eighty five percent chance is just, you just got that dog in you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, yeah. uh, yes, sir. Yeah. No, yes. You got the gamble. Yeah, I also I have personal <laughs> reasons for uh, for doing that that I may may or may not tell at some point. Is that I, bad like I got. This. <laughs> <He's>... <laughs> yeah. I'm a flyer surfing. <laughs> are you? Wait, what, are you gonna buy? Your... <laughs> I. I don't know. He wanted to buy everyone a dragon lore. <laughs> yeah, that's my personal <laughs> reason. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
Oh, that's a, that's a fire motive, I can't lie. Fuck. <clears throat> oh, I'm just gonna... <laughs> bruh, <laughs> bruh, bruh, listen to my answer and fucking dip. Cool, Mystic, I got a second request for you, a bit more of a existential one, if you will. Oh my god, I hate you. Love it. I know you love a good existential question. So I've had a lot of problems around. with existentiality recently. Or not recently, oh. like the past months. Do you me <laughs> No, go ahead. I'm kidding. Uh, like, it's fun now. <laughs> I, I don't know, dude. I, I watch Donnie Dark, or I'm in the same position. And I, um, yeah, there fuck, what do you call it? Um, if you could like upload like your consciousness onto like mm -hmm. the internet or like onto like the web, right? Mm -hmm. Um, um, and like you'd be able to like essentially like live forever. Um, and you'd be able to like let's say you'd be able to test it out first to see if you like enjoyed like living in that format, whatever, right? That's yeah. fine. Um, but like you. <sighs> Like, my question is, like, so I guess, the first question would be, like, would you do it? And the second question would be, like, if you had the option to, like, let's say, like, kill, like, your human body, because there'd be, like, two of you otherwise, like, would you do it? Dude, so, this is a very, very, very big question. Um, because yeah. essentially, I I've thought about this before. I've thought about this concept before. Obviously, yeah. the... I think it's interesting, this is a whole different thing, but, like, living forever is undesirable, you know? I don't wanna... Because of the human experience, I think it is just... Like, obviously, I don't wanna die, you know? And nobody wants to die. <laughs> or, some people wanna die, but, you know, the, the like, normally... <laughs> normally, you wouldn't wanna die, right? But, no one wants to live forever is a thing. No one wants to live forever. That's like a, that's like a, uh, no, you know? But if you upload your mind, uh, upload your mind to like the web or some sort of, in my mind, that becomes kind of uh, like generated utopia. And in that place, you would be able to uh, like change you know, the values around. Like, you wouldn't have to rely on having to do stuff and accomplish things to be happy. You could just, like, increase happiness, you know? That's all, like, uh, like, cha like, changeable. And so I've pondered whether or not living forever would be desirable if you could make this false happiness, you know? if Because, you know, it removes the humanity of it, uh, and that kind of is eerie looking at it now it's from my from my life. human form but if i could live in eternity and happiness uh then like i don't know that sounds good <laughs> that sounds nice i've it's definitely like i mean you could, that's possible just from the like the idea that like let's say like who you are right now in like the very moment let's say mm -hmm. you're happy in that moment like you could just replay that moment yeah. Like, you wouldn't even need to create a new memory. Like, yeah. you could just replay that, right? Yeah. So, like, yeah, it'd definitely be possible from that standpoint. Um, yeah, I guess JoJo has just hopped in, so it'd be interesting. I think it, I think it would give you... I think question. if you... I think... Uh, did you hear the question, JoJo? I heard the question. It, it's basically uh, if you were able to live forever, right? No, no if you, uh, if you got the chance... I guess it's kind of that, but, like, if no, you... I, 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 yeah, it's partly it's, it's, pa I, it's, it's part partly of it. to like increase lifespan, but like it's more about like I guess like if you were like able to upload it, like one like would you would you be okay if with you that? were like, able to like, up, you... like upload your mind to the web, uh, and and you know multiple... live live through that conscious, uh, would you do it and like kill your human body? Yeah, I think my, my it's a very scary a bet body. to make because it like I'm comfortable. In my life right now and although it's not always comfortable and you know you deal with a lot of problems i think i after having thought about it for a while even though existing is scary uh in the volatile form that it takes place like now that we're experiencing i think it's still uh an overall like good experience and i think you can live a fulfilling life and come through with like 
happiness at the end. But, like, if you upload your conscious, you're basically taking a bet on, like, a new thing that you you have no guarantee that uh, there will be happiness or if you will be able to, like... It's just a completely new way of experiencing being alive, which I think is a scary bet to make because it could last for eternity. It's like, the worst possible outcome is that you are signing up for, like, an eternity in hell, you know? And the, it's, you know, it's like, you, you see what I'm saying. You see what I'm saying. Let me just paint the, let me paint the parameters of, like, one, like, I guess, like, if you don't, like, kill your human body, like, you're still living, right? Or I guess it depends on, like, which one you would consider yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. If, I, if your conscious exists um, somewhere, I would I, consider you alive. Can I add one parameter? Yeah, yes. go What if you had a kill switch in it? So, so this is the prem. Let me paint the prem. It's like very clearly now, out for you guys, just to like make it clean. So you're up you have the option to like up upload it onto the the web, right? Uh -huh. I mean, you can try it out, whatever. You do have the option to like you kill can... switch yourself, right? Okay, right, so Kendra, you can you try it and like... then go back if you if so, you're so, not fucking so, with you know, it? So these are these are the specifics I'm giving you. You can have the option to a upload it at all. You know that's the optional mm -hmm. but also if you do upload it you have a like a k kill switch but that kill switch is the your consciousness in the computer not like your human self mm -hmm. um and the other option is that you're allowed to kill your human body but only in the instant that you upload it because once you finish uploading it like you're i consider it a different person and you don't have like a choice on like whether that person like lives or dies anymore because it's like a different uh, person you know okay so that's a very moral question, right? Because yeah, I mean, like the, 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 the what way is, I'm putting what it is, is like what is what is purpose if there is no end? Yes, uh, and also uh, fire serpy. Um, fire serpy. And also, what is purpose? The the question becomes also what is purpose if there is no purpose? Because like if you can, if you can uh, yeah. artificially manipulate your own. Uh, existence like your own happiness and your own comfortability then like it becomes very weird it becomes very very abstract very very quickly uh and i don't know i don't know <laughs> it's interesting it's different it's I interesting I, to think about I, I i would i would definitely uh think about it more if i was uploaded to it to the digital substrate than if I was to be immortal in this universe. Yeah. In the physical Immortality universe. in the physical universe is definitely a no. 100% no. Oh, I actually I actually have thought, uh, talked to my brother about this a lot. And he says for him it's definitely a yes. That is crazy. I think that is one of... That's like the scariest thing. And like when I was deep in my existential hole. And like, like really... A couple months ago, it was real bad. Like, I was, like, freaking out, having panic attacks about it, like, every day. Um, but that was, like, my main thing, was that, like, I didn't enjoy my day-to-day. -day. I didn't have any meaning. Uh, very existential, like, crisis type of stuff. And then I was, like, what if this lasts forever? There's no guarantee that, like, it was getting very, like, philosophical and, like strange and you know you're you're scared of dying uh but at the same time you fear being alive and it's very very like strange and so my biggest fear in that period was like that i would live forever uh but at the same time like that i would die tomorrow it was so like fucked <laughs> and so like uh, that's burned so hard into my mind like no i don't want to live forever 100 percent not fuck that that's like, that's like the, I think, I think there is no, I think there is no worse, uh, punishment than, and, and that kind of. Well, with, with an end goal then, what do you think the purpose of your life is? Dude, I've like, that's the thing. <laughs> You're gonna put me back in the hole? I think it's fine as long as, I think, you know, the purpose of my life, I don't serve any greater purpose. I think I've come to terms with the fact that there is no greater purpose. Mm -hmm. uh, and that as long as I am able to uh, achieve my, like, primal, you know, goals. You know, it's just like, you know, you want to fucking settle down, have a family, like, do stuff. I heard, 
I heard a good uh, one. One of my coworkers talked about the meaning of life uh, because I asked him, um, and he said that he heard on Lex Friedman somebody somebody who was on Lex Friedman said that his purpose in life was uh, that like he would ride um, the ups and downs of um, like indulging yourself into. Uh, like a specific subject as many times as he could. So he saw it like you would find something uh, like let's say fucking electronics or something, you know? Electronics and you would study it and you would go like super deep into it, make it your life and then try to like further your understanding of that and then go out, ponder about existence, uh, you know, get into the philosophical, the artsy, and then go back into like a new subject and just ride that roller coaster like a lot. And I think there's some merit to that because it gives you value. I think it gives you value just to uh, analyze your existence a lot of the time. Okay, so but it, but it, you don't want to go too deep still... into you don't want to go too deep into like anything. I don't think that no, serves no, any no, greater value. <laughs> I, mean, I, I think this this would I think this would still hold if, even if you were immortal though. Yes, but the but the problem is you're gonna run out of things. In, like oh, that, that, people that, that, people that, that, underestimate. That, 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 I think. Is so big. You I, can always do other I think you underestimate um, the concept of infinity. Is the thing. I think you do because you're saying there I, is no infinity because there is only so much stuff. N yeah, no, I no. Underestimate it. I think I overestimate it. I think there's too much infinity for a, hum a an individual human mind to ever experience. So I think that say you would live forever <clears throat> i would just you know jump from planet to planet experiencing uh, uh, mystic, i'm just interested what is what is your like viewpoint on like so like we talk about like living forever like infinity mm -hmm. right mm -hmm. what do you think happens to you like a million like years or if you build, like what what do you think like you become do you mean your like, body I guess, like, as, like, uh, more, like, okay more, like, in like, this no, like, in this like, hypothetical mentally, like what do you think happens what what do you think like Oh, so what do you think, like, because you obviously uh, in, like, the bad light, what do you think, like, the breakdown is? Like, what do you think happens when you get, like, you know, a few billion years down the line? I think you realize, um, that you have experienced as much as you need to. Uh, I guess if you could live forever, but you could kill yourself eventually, that would be good. I think that would be like the best option. Yeah, that would be the best option. Yeah, because like if you're locked into an infinite life, you're uh, that's like that's like too much. It's too much for the mind, I think. I think you can't I think you can't you can't comprehend infinity in that way. Like you don't understand and obviously I don't either, but I think I place a lot more weight on it. You don't understand the concept of living a billion years. I that is so that much with, time. I would argue that with an infinite amount of time, you would eventually come to a conclusion, though, and actually realize what that means. I think... Um... Hmm. <clears throat> The thing is that I don't think there's any answer uh, in the universe. I don't think there's any greater oh, there goal. There's puzzles. There's a there's a lot of puzzles, right? But like, even you know, eventually you get bored, <laughs> and you know, yeah, you can go you can go from place to place and you can experience new things, but you are trapped in in like the box that is your existence, no matter what. I think eventually you will go insane from knowing that you exist within your mind, you know, and that there's nothing you can do about that and you're going to have to be like that forever. And I think being, like, going insane from that knowledge and having to live with it for eternity is, like, eventually you, I think you build your own, like, hell out of it. I think that is a concept. I think it's pessimistic. We, I, no, that's not pessimistic. I think it is a construct that is created when you have a finite life. And I think those 
Mm. Now you lose the scale of it all shifts when you actually go immortal. Maybe. Do you feel do you think it would just be like let's say this is like a like a switch, you know, you just hit it and now you're immortal and you're aware of it? Do you think as soon as you're aware that you're immortal, uh your view on life would change? No, that would be do, more gradual. It would be gradual, okay. Yes, because you are going to then have to adjust every scale you've been operating Ooh. under to infinity. I and don't know, that, dude. Th that, 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 for one, is going to take you time. But as soon as you are, uh, as, as you gradually adjust, you're going to see the possibilities of what you can undo. <coughs> and I think life could still, still be fulfilling in that, uh, in, in such a situation. Do you think, yeah, but like, what is fulfillment without a conclusion, kind of? Like what? That is what you will find out when you. Yeah, when you do it. but that's a that's a scary bet to be yes. like there will be fulfillment would would still exist despite there not being a conclusion. I that's a that scary, scary bet. Scary bet. Yes, and that's why the question is so hard. Yeah, dude, I don't think it's hard at all. I I definitely I think. Completed it, mate. I, I think, uh, yeah, no, I think that my answer is definitely no, 100%, I would not go immortal, because, because the, the, like, I don't, I think if you, I don't enjoy my existence enough, and I don't feel like it's, uh, like it's so, um, like, I've become aware of the volatility um of like my experience it can change a lot depending on what you know and how you think and i think with an infinite time to think you will eventually stumble into a hole that you can't get yourself out of and being alive Infinitely, it's just yeah. I've, so then, I, I think I it's scary. Think so I think it's scary. You you are also aware of the fact that you have infinite time to figure it out. <sighs> yeah. That is that is a, a and that is very important because uh, if you have a finite time to figure it out, you want to figure it out because yeah. you need to you you need to be able to do other. Stuff. Because I fear death is like the ultimate thing. Is that you know I'm fearful of death and so, and so I'm fearful of a painful existence. Yes, uh, uh, while it is, is here, is while it is finite exists. and has its, uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. its uh, the majority of its time being uh, in pain. Yeah, yeah, that's a big risk. Yeah, I understand, but I don't think I fear these grandiose concepts as much as I fear uh, just feeling bad. I mean, just the feeling in itself is, uh, you know, enough to sway me. I don't need to think about these large philosophical. Uh, like conundrums uh, of like do I fear death or not I'm just like you know if I'm in pain I'm in pain and I think if you're if you have infinite time to think eventually you will you will come to infinite pain uh, that just I, I think maybe maybe I'm just depressed <laughs> I don't know not sure. no, I'm, I'm not, not sure, sure. I, I think I've I, I, I've uh, brought up a similar concept to my bro and no. that is something he admitted to i think but i'm not sure how that conversation is <laughs> it's anymore. it's something to think i just about. don't want to gamble yeah. with my existence is the thing because that's a yeah. it's a big yeah. it's a very 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 big and like yeah. especially when you bring in the concept of infinity into anything uh that has to do with my existence it just becomes so much scarier because it it carries literal like unimaginable weight the the ups and downs become i mean they become infinite is the thing uh and so you don't know where you're going to land you don't I think know that's going to i think that should lead to uh, a a large amount of stability Mm. Eventually, the the ups and downs are all realized, all have been looked at from every different angle, and you find some sort of clarity within. That's and then maybe, what? And then what is the thing? Because you then, you find that clarity. 
you find that clarity within, and you still have infinite time to think about it. And then you go find another puzzle. Hmm. Maybe. I guess to pull it back a little bit, I'm, I'm kind of interested in, like, your view on, like, like, okay, you upload, like, your brain to, like, the computer or whatever, right? And you have the kill switch option, right? So if you don't like it or you don't want it to go on for any, like, you can stop it at any point, right? Yeah. Um, but, like, I'd test it I'm out. Really I'd test it like, out, yeah. Yeah, yeah, my, my viewpoint would be, would you kill, like, your body in the real world? And would you be okay with, like, either one of those, I guess? Because, like, mm. essentially you'd have two of yourself now, right? Obviously, think, like, they would I don't think be different I, people, at, like, a few minutes into it because they'd be different experiences, but would you be okay with someone that was, like, convinced that I guess they would... You? You know, you'd have that, like, weird dynamic now. Yeah, I think I would be fine with having a clone. A digital clone. That's interesting. I don't because yeah, you kind too, of have because... a weird thing where you have two people living different lives, but they both claim to kind of be you, you know? Yeah. Listen, this is interesting. If you have the kill switch option, but you don't have to kill your body, so it's it's staying in cryo sleep, and you can turn it back on exactly where you were mm -hmm. as soon as you kill your digital self, right? Then that is so, infinite knowledge. That is literally so, what that is literally singularity. So the way that I'm putting this is, you can upload your brain to a computer, and that compute like the brain in the computer can like live forever. You can have a kill switch, and it can experience stuff, right? Mm -hmm. Um, but. Um, when you, like, it'll, like, scan your brain, like, make a copy, um, and in that second you can decide, like, or beforehand you can say, okay, like, I don't want, like, my body, I don't want to have, like, two of me, I only want one of me. Mm -hmm. Um, but the second, like, it scans that, like, you, you, you stand up by the machine or whatever, and that body carries on, so there's, like, two of you now, there's one in the computer and there's one of you in real life. Um, but you don't, the computer one doesn't get any more say, or whichever one, I guess, you view as yourself, but they don't get any say on each other anymore yeah the no they're they're separate one, oh, but the they're both the, the, the human the human one can't say okay i want i want the the robot one done and the the other way around like those are now two separate things like would do you think you'd be okay with the idea that like there would be two like there'd be one you know Ooh. you get the idea like, i i have i have an interesting question it, you know well it doesn't matter because as soon as <laughs> one somebody uh, one person makes the decision to do that then everybody is going to get cloned Okay, uh, let me, let me, uh, side note, right, uh, I just thought of this, like, on the side of, uh, of you explaining all of that. What if, right, <clears throat> there are two copies of yourself, one digital, one physical, like you, and then a digital copy of yourself, <clears throat> yep. and you, like, you're both you, obviously, um and you I'm not having any of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and <laughs> pair 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 joined and he was like, what the fuck? And then he left. Um and you have to like uh to be able to kill off one of the versions, right? Both have to agree on which one has to go. Yeah. Okay. Do you think both would come to the same conclusion, like if you have to kill one of them, right? Do you yeah. think both of them would come to the same conclusion? Yes, I think Do so. you think so? Because, yeah. like, okay, they're both you, but they're both separate entities that want to protect themselves, well, right? I don't think they'd come... Why, why do you think they'd come to the same conclusion, Jojo? Unless they didn't know who they were. Because it's me. If that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what I'm thinking. It, but it's like, it's like, yeah, you it's it, you. Don't know which ones themselves. Both, oh, both of them are you, and both of you will think the same that. thing. I don't even need that. Like, if if I if if I have a conversation with myself, saying like, okay, let's decide on we're we're gonna decide on someone to kill. Who is gonna be? Then, for one, I would probably go as far as to say I already know that I will be keeping my digital self, hmm. and also that decision will come quick. But because do you think that I your value... physical self and your digital self will both, like, agree just instinctively? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Because, so, I think... Because, we, because, one, we are guaranteed that one of us is going to live on. And that we are the same. So, that, for me, solves the philosophical conundrum already. And I says, like, that can... should be fine. That is me. I don't That's think me. we can say they're the same. 
um, I guess, like, in my viewpoint of this, I'm not treating yeah, them exactly the same. the same, because one of them thinks of themselves as a computer, and one of them thinks of the So they're already different in at least a tiny regard, right? Like, yeah. th that's at least a difference. Like, they can't be identical in this okay. situation. They have what, if, really what if I change it? Slight difference, so what if I change it to that there is two physical clones? You know, okay. it's yeah, you that's, that's, that's and a, a yeah, and a and definitely. a physical clone of you, and you okay, have yes. you have to come to terms. You and your other physical self have to come to an agreement of which one is going to die. You know, you don't know which one's the original. Then, that's then I would never be able to figure it out. Yeah, I'd probably just flip a coin. <laughs> that's <laughs> holy shit, Roboto. That's no, genius. Then I would never be able to figure it out, and I would do everything <laughs> to keep both alive. Mm -hmm. that, that, that's um, that's um, my, my, me, yeah, me and my boys you would... are doing that. We're, we're going to the coin flip. <laughs> we're going for the gamble. <laughs> it, it, it's going to depend upon who has the fucking fire serpent. <laughs> the fire serpent statty. Who got rich, yeah, who got rich enough in their lives to get the statty? Just turned into a mock the fire serpent statty out of Brahma <laughs> Kingston. <laughs> um... Yeah, no, the, the reason I guess I'm asking, like, is because it's, like, a weird dynamic where, like, like, are you okay with, like, someone, like, considering themselves you? Because it's kind of, like, a personal thing, almost, that you're having to give up, right? Because you're giving, not so, um, so almost someone else, like, who you are, you know? There's mm -hmm. no two of you. But I've already kind of disconnected to that idea of yeah. I am, because I could be hallucinating all of this i could be <laughs> not real and i think oh do you mean your existence saying, saying my existence is me as a label is weird to me my existence is is purely speculative and only confirmed by people who observe me your existence is no you're by you no 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 talking to me and interacting with me. no 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 jojo your existence is only uh, like it only exists within your mind. I'm just seeing you. I don't know. Like I could be hallucinating. Is the thing. Exactly. So that, yeah. That, so then, so then my, so then me observing you doesn't prove your existence. I think it. Because you're only a part of my mind. And my mind is my existence. Yeah. So. And, and our, both our minds are confirming that both of us are real because we are able to interact with each other. I think uh, uh, each of those interactions or uh, well, memories, I guess. Yeah, no, like yeah, like because we can't access each other, uh, each other's minds. So it's just like you're. From my from my per yeah from my perspective, uh, I could I could never know, and you <laughs> none none of like anyone could ever know if anything is real and that's that i mean that's just what we're arguing here is just like and then if if we go back to the original question what does it so even who be dies? Real mean? you are the clone then who is even the real one you can, you would never be able to figure out i don't know i had a different that's i had like a different saying, thought I, that's like saying cut out one of your parallel universes yeah which is <laughs> yeah <laughs> true which one, which but like would you pick? would you come to i don't know and, and yeah, we, we, I guess they would. A morally sound conclusion of which one was objectively but the I worst thought, one. But I thought of a different thing, like a different tangent here. And that is that if there is a clone of you, right? If there pops in a clone identical to you in this instant, right? Uh, right beside you. It will eventually deviate from you because you can't, you like physically can't be doing the exact same thing in the well, exact be, same yeah, pa in place. The second, yeah. Of yeah. Course. That, yeah. That's kind of why I'm asking about the computer one, because they are different experiences the second it happens. Yeah, the, like, after it happens, after the clone is, uh, is popped into existence, it will deviate, little by little, and so its thought patterns and everything is going... Like, even it standing across the room looking at you versus you standing here looking at it is going, like, there's a different perspective... Yeah, and then and so that's so, why I think it should be considered a different human entirely, and then you can never make the morally right choice of who to kill. Well, I don't know if you can, like, I'm not arguing whether you can make a morally correct choice. I'm just like, would you, do you think you'd come to a conclusion with, no. like, just like, yeah, I'll go. Uh, no. <laughs> I, I got you, bro. <laughs> Nah, nah, well, maybe if he's like, if he's like nice or something, I don't know. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> maybe 
Maybe if one of them is suicidal and says like, okay, well, I'll go get it. <laughs> you know, that, that, that just, nah, that's impossible to solve. Yeah. No, I know, I know. I just thought about it. No, okay, I'm gonna rope. I'm gonna rope pair back into the original question. Are you there? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Here's the question, Pat. So, you have the option to upload your brain onto like the web, right? Um, so you'd be able to live forever. Um, but you'd also I'm be able, able to like. Call, just... call <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> his answer is he doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> Shut the hell up about all this nerdy ass shit. No, I love conversations like this, but uh, I wanna have a they really take life. a toll on my mental, especially if I let it consume me. That's what I was talking about earlier, where it's like you wanna you wanna ride the roller coaster, uh, but you never wanna go too far in any direction because like it becomes all consuming of your life if you completely completely indulge in a subject especially with like i've realized that the that the more um i i was gonna say the older i get but like i'm not old <laughs> but like the more grown up i get the more powerful my mind becomes and so uh these thoughts mean a lot more you know and so del like like, delving deep into, uh, any topic is, like, more exhausting on the mental. What up? But also, like, you can go Are deeper. Are you able to talk now, Pat? Maybe. What's up? Okay, question. Here we go. You you have the option to upload your brain into, like, the web. Um, yes. so you'd be, bringing, like, a, you'd be able to make, like, a conscience of yourself online, um, and it would be able to, like, you'd be able to, like, end it so, like, you could live forever, or, but you can end it, like, any, any time you want. Um, when you upload it onto the web, um, you have the option to, like, kill your physical body so there's not two of you, otherwise you have a physical version of you going around. The option is, the question is, would you, A, like, upload it, and two, would you, like, kill your physical self? Would I upload my brain to the internet, and would I kill myself if I did that? Yeah. Yeah, those oh, are the yeah. two questions, yeah. Uh... You can ask any, like, questions, like, clarifying questions. Doesn't have to. What can I do on the internet? Do I have... <laughs> so, the, the opportunity, I guess, is that you'd be able to live forever, so your consciousness would be kind of... It'd still be able to like grow and learn, but it would be, you'd be able to have the option to live forever, right? Um, so you wouldn't die of old age. Um, Can and I kill you myself? Probably... In yeah, so it's... yeah, so that's why I said you have the option as well, so you don't have to like go on forever. So at any time, like, you can like pull the plug on this. You can't, not the physical version, but like your consciousness on there can like turn, you know? Yeah, cut itself off forever. You can't it. kill yourself the physical version. <laughs> like, yeah, you, the physical self can't do that. So once you upload it, <laughs> that's the only time you get to kill your physical self, because then I consider it like a deviation. Um, but the secondary yeah, question is more of like, would you be okay with like having like two versions of yourself, right? Uh... Uh, yes, and uh, I don't really like care if I kill myself. Or yeah, I don't really care about having a copy of me, like physical, digital, like whatever. I don't care about having a copy. I'm more the thing is that after after you asked that question, it kind of deviated I, into uh, the prospect of immortality and a, living forever, a, uh, well, like without a kill switch. Uh, but the way I see that, that other person, that physical body, that's just a different person. Yeah. Yes, I'm so sorry I joined. I'm gonna leave. No. I don't know what. No, I'm you can stay, Maya. To. Maya, we want to no, ask you to. I'm I want to ask you to. I want to ask scared. you to. Maya. The the actual question, the actual interesting question, because I think that one is that one's interesting. But I feel like we got a lot more out of out of the other one, which was like, if you could live forever. Um, but like you couldn't kill yourself. Like you have to live for an infinite amount like, of time. Live forever. Yeah. Like, would you take that? Um, mm. that possibility. 
Uh, I think so. Because, Oof. like, yeah, it would be sad, like, everyone dying and stuff. But, like, you would eventually forget, like, thousands of years later. I think... Base. And, like, <laughs> you, can, you can fall in love again. And, like, you can have... Like, you can see, like, your great, 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 <laughs> great grandchildren. And, like, I don't know. It's kind of crazy, but it's kind of cool. Fresh look. Uh, and we haven't even touched about like uh, relatives around us when True. we make this choice. Yeah, what have you guys been talking about? Okay, no, no, no. Because because I've I've been oh thinking God. about the concept of like of infinity. Is that like I feel like you're um, like world ending? No, 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 no. Like just experiencing, like being. A human forever, I don't think is like a is like a good thing. I think I think you find I think you find satisfaction uh, in the fact that there is a conclusion. You know, like you have to you have to Dude, do stuff while you're here. Turn into a furry, like fucking, you can live. Fucking. Like that's true. Like, <laughs> fucking what the hell? Can that's you crazy. die? No. Like, at all? No. Like you can't die. No. You are you so are there for an infinite amount of time. And that's what I I don't want you to uh, I don't want you to underestimate the concept of infinity. Yeah. And yeah. You, you will so also like, always be at peak physical health. Yeah. Uh, oh my god. So like you rob a bank, right? Say it goes bad. Like even if it doesn't like turn out good, say it goes bad, mm -hmm. you're in prison, Good but shot. like you're not gonna yeah. die, right? So yeah. once you get out of prison, you try to rob another bank. <laughs> say that one goes bad, you get out again. You what? Rob my, but what is the concept? My, you get my, so much money. Maya, what is the concept Jesus. of money <laughs> when you have infinite life? Yeah, like it That's doesn't no, matter. But, no, you're, but like you you're saying assisted. you would be stuck being a human, but you can have like any job, eventually. You can be a furry if you want. You're going to win like, the end of yeah, the earth. You will outlive. Life. You will outlive humanity. I, yeah, but like you're saying, it's going to get like really boring, constantly being I'm, human. I'm but not. Like, I mean, that's you know. part of it, but also, like, there's so like there's so much substance in like living forever that it's like unfathomable i don't think i don't think i would you cannot fathom it Maya. you can't yeah you yeah, cannot but... fathom infinity <laughs> is what it is and none of us can and so it's a very scary scary decision so yeah, i think that like... will change if you go infinite hmm. no i don't think why do you think your why do you think your mind would suddenly like Bro, you I don't know, think you would, I don't think you would, yeah, I mean, you gotta live with it. Limitless. You change your concept, you change your scales, you change uh, the, the, you change mm, your eventually. based on mm. time. I don't agree. I think it's You can literally plan a top forever if you wanted to, it doesn't matter, you yeah. won't get bored. I think you'll always find new universal puzzles. You can always, like, I don't know, I think it would be cool, because, like, you can just be like, I want to go to Norway. Boom, you're in Norway. I want to go to New Lisa. And, like, I like I like my view on this. this is so <laughs> I think like, like you can live. Like, <laughs> I think it's everywhere. I think it's funny how short-sighted like you're looking at it. Is the thing, no, but but I think <laughs> I think it's definitely more enjoyable to think of it that, that way. No, like it. obviously you can be like, well, I don't want to live forever because like forever is forever. Yeah. Like, if you don't die, forever, you have to ever? experience <laughs> every single bad thing that happens in the world. But you can also experience every single good thing that happens in the world. Yeah. But I so, think. Based. There we and go. you learn as you go. So eventually, like, judging people and, like, you won't have that many mistakes because you've already done all of them. But what do you do? Okay, Maya, explain this to me. Everything. When, yeah, when humanity is gone, right? You have uh -huh. no one, like, you have literally no one to connect with. You have no reference point that you're, like, you're talking about now. Like, oh, like, you don't even have to think about, like, what anyone else, like, blah, blah, blah. 
like you're t you're thinking about the now. Okay, the million years in the future, maybe humanity's gonna be here. Who knows? But then when everything's gone. Like, when Earth is gone, when, like, every reference point that you have to your existence now is gone, and you still have an infinite amount of time left to then, just sit and ponder and exist, yeah, do you think you, that won't... You go skit. <laughs> you go absolutely you think, crazy. You yes. who you are. You're talking to, like, the one do... leaf that's left in the world. <laughs> like, you just I go know. crazy at that point, but then you're crazy, so it doesn't matter. Like you can live that's scary. You live until you go mad. Would that be an argument for like pushing to like create life then? Hmm? What are you saying? Like if you're saying everyone's yeah, gone, like there's an argument that like you can like recreate. Yeah. Life, but, like, oh, yeah. that's. No, that would be sick that's... too. Yeah, interesting. You start the cycle again. If you can do that yeah. before you go crazy. You could biologically yeah. engineer yeah. life yeah. and then keep it forever because you are the like. You are the you guardian are, that can never god. die. You are you god, are yeah. God. No, yeah. Like that is, that, okay, that, I guess the final Whoa. end game is you generate so much knowledge because of infinite You become god. Knowledge. You're you become a god. And what if wow. what if you what if this is our escape? I just want you guys to know I have what been recording cycle? for <laughs> an hour, <laughs> for an hour. Yeah. What if we oh live in a cycle of of eventually some consciousness in the universe? becoming god be finding infinite scale of time becoming god and then creating their own universe yeah that's, yeah, uh, that's definitely that could be that is a that is an escape scenario and that is uh, could be wow. our, our plus what's singularity. the and also, What's the alternative? I don't know if I want that. Okay, so if the the alternative, alternative is you live a normal life. <laughs> so we, have, yeah. we have to keep in mind. We have to keep in mind this one thing. It is this is an individual question. If everybody was immortal, singularity, godhood, we would. It doesn't. Be, uh, that that would go so fast. Like then our complete focus shifts. We have, we would completely abolish war because it has no purpose. Yeah. We would completely Oops. abolish That's true. for any resources because we can get them anywhere. Like, a lot of the fucking scales shift at that point. That's... And then I think, I think that's hard. something you didn't consider as well. Yeah, I didn't. Like, so we're talking about, like, an infinite, but, like, the way you're viewing it is, like, okay, eventually, like, I'm gonna run out of stuff to do and I'm gonna, like, start to, like, you know, kind of lose it. But yeah. then I guess you also have to consider, like, you have an infinite amount of time to, like, find purpose and, like, do other stuff, right? Like, anything, any, like, hole you find yourself in, you have an infinite amount of time that you'll eventually get out of it almost, you know? Yeah. So it's you have to consider the prison. flip side. Like, no matter how bad it gets, you're, you're gonna have an infinite amount of time to recover from that as well. Yeah. Think about all the drugs you can do. Like, you well, can do anything I mean, I can you want and I not die. Like, my, all of, all of my stuff is, like, stuff we can do at the yeah, moment. Yeah, uh, that's... Uh, I think it's really funny. I think it's really funny how you're, like, looking at, like... All the good things. <laughs> like, there's so many good things. Yeah. It's a bad thing. And you know what? I think... You are definitely enjoying life more than I am <laughs> through <laughs> through what I'm hearing right now, yeah. which is um, it's very interesting. I don't know. I but just... that is that is gonna be your ultimate purpose. I think the the meaning of your life becomes experiencing. Yeah. Yeah. But I also think All I also I think if your possible. ultimate goal, I think if you take on um, this role as like God, you know. Then that will be that will be your goal is to become like like a true well, yeah, like yeah. god. It, it's yeah. gonna happen eventually. It will happen eventually because you yeah, have an infinite universe time. Universe collapses and then you can go on and do other stuff and fuck around Mystic. for a bit. Think, think about Mystic, the stuff that you to... can do. Like you can cure cancer. Oh my you god. You can like build different. Dude, oh you can god. jump off. Listen to the Amazing Spider-Man song. <laughs> jump off a skyscraper. Boom! And you're having so much fun. You don't die. Oh, wait, Mystic, I got a question for you. Here's a nice question yeah, for you, or, or an interesting one. Mm -hmm. So, Mystic, I'm going to give you, you have to pick a purpose, right? Mm -hmm. um, a goal. Mm -hmm. But when you complete that goal, you're going to die. What, mm -hmm. what do you pick? Oh, I have to pick something? So you have to pick a purpose or a goal, and Open whatever that question is, up. when you complete that, you're going to die. That... <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, no, because this is... Uh... A side effect of this question is that if I don't complete my goal, I don't die. Yeah. Uh, 
So you just so, don't work on it. Yeah, so don't work on it until you want to die. Yeah. Uh, so it's basically just it's basically immortality with a with a kill switch, which is uh, which is what I agreed to earlier. No, but let's say like take away like the trying to like think the system, but like try and treat it as like a goal that you'd actually like want to complete. That you'd be like, like cure cancer. Is that I mean, what you, you were, were thinking about? Because like, Maya said that. That you'd be like consent. It'd be something that you like you'd be content with. Like try and I guess treat the question as like fairly as you can. I guess. Yeah. Uh, I think it would. I don't want to over, uh, to like overbear myself. I would definitely, uh, want it to be something that would just like benefit humanity because at the end of the day, we all just live so that we, uh, like can, that, so that people will remember us. Right. So if you do something extra like extraordinary in your lifetime, you will be remembered. And a lot of people find so uh, like, solace in that is solace the right word uh they find like content i guess I yeah like content yeah I think I've been up what, what is solace like, what is solace like what's the definition data. of solace uh quantum of solace i guess um but like i think i definitely don't want something to be like you know find the purpose of existence or whatever like some grandiose thing i definitely want it to just be like like Something that's definitely possible, like cure cancer, for example, like what Maya said. It's like, it's definitely possible, we just don't know, we just don't know how to do it, and whoever does it, you know, it's gonna be, a, like, a big deal. So I think that would, that would, I think I'd set that, cure cancer, and then I'd just work on that. Whenever, <laughs> whenever I see it. Whenever you feel like it. Yeah. I like that. I think that would be good. Without think without thinking about it too much. <laughs> Get a live coat. You can do that now. I yeah. would want to see I would want to see every every uh galaxy. That see now. <laughs> I would want I would want to visit every galaxy. See like I... what what happens if you do like go to Mars and then your ship crashes? Fuck what Mars, are you, what are you I'm going, going to do? Andromeda. I know, but like, what are you gonna? You have do? to live. Like, I'll spend you an infinity it, are, are figuring it out. Gonna, yeah. Are you if gonna you, risk, if you, like getting blown up and then you just float in the so galaxy if forever? I, if I'm stuck in the gravitational trap of a black hole, I'll just wait my infinity and then get out. Yeah. Until black, like, oh, black holes <laughs> decay. Radiates away. <laughs> until someone sees you. Again. No. 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 Until, no, they, no. until the black, black hole radiates radia away. Yeah, they radiate uh, away. Okay. Okay, my, 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 back, back to reality for a second. I'm that is reality, you, motherfucker! I'm, I, I'm, I'm, <laughs> giving you some, I'm, giving, I'm giving you some free money here, Maya. I gotta ask him the money question. Maya, I give you a 100% chance of getting 2 million dollars. <laughs> or an 85% We're back. chance. Or an 85% chance of getting 25 million dollars. I gotta bring it back to reality, you guys. You guys are talking about fucking playing Angry Birds. I'm not. <laughs> Angry Birds <Yeah>. forever? <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> what, so it's two million a hundred percent versus eighty five percent of twenty five million. Yes, correct. Two million, because then you can flip it into twenty five eventually. Yeah, <laughs> that's what that's what Pear said. It's like but I I got that dog in me. It. I'm I'm taking the I'm taking the eighty five percent. Come on now. But like why? <laughs> like we were just talking about cancer. Like the chances of getting that. Okay. It's crazy, and everyone. Gets that. <laughs> what? Like, I, I could, I what? I could still get cancer whether or not I have two million dollars or fucking you know nothing. We're talking about like the slight chance that you do get that. Like it's such a small percentage, and then you're going to take eighty-five percent instead of a hundred percent. Yeah. Just, just use the money to get more money. It's not like if the fifteen. Uh, no, it's, no, it's not like if like, I get twenty five mil, I get cancer. You. Yeah, you don't uh, got the like, dog in you. I'm t I'm you don't, taking you don't the. I'm taking the chance. You don't get odds like that anywhere else. Yeah. Let's, hear you, let's hear your bark. You got that puppy in you. Yeah. All right, all right. Uh, I'm down. <laughs> I mean, you are. I think it's, my it's, it's my time to leave. I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you for joining. <laughs> you put you put me back to reality. Though we were like really, really deep in the fucking sauce. Oh, yeah. Anytime, anytime you guys got <clears throat> debates like that, I guess.
Let me, uh, let me in. I'll fix it. You'll come through with the... The modern... You'll come through with the... You'll come through with the so... The <laughs> whatever, whatever. <laughs> yeah, the sobering thoughts, really. True. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, <laughs> have a good night, guys. Yeah, good night. Good night. Dude, that was so funny. When she joined us, she was just like the most like what like. What the fuck did I walk into? The, yeah, and then she and then we asked her, and she came with the most like close range. It's like I could like I could like go outside and like jump off of my roof, and it's like okay. <laughs> maybe we are going too deep into it. We maybe we're overthinking it. Maybe fun. Mara, what do you think? I like green. Great. Yeah. Oh, this is a this is a really rare skin. It's a blue collection skin. Factory. Uh, it's worth like six or seven bucks. You could trade it up into an op fade or something. Eventually. Maybe or maybe a welcome. I think it's a welcome to the jungle. Actually. You know, the guy's gonna surprise you. To check my inventory. Made my CS. Did you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, check my inventory. He showed me a dumb card. Alright, I'm checking it. What do you think? Robot, are you interested though? This knife glove combo or not? Nah, not. You say nah? I, I think I heard nah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. No worries. No shwerries. <sighs> no shwerries. Oh, by the way, Mystic, uh, Tonkar said the Talon. Doppler Phase 2 was better than the Bowie Sapphire. Interesting. I think the Bowie Sapphire is better. Yeah. yeah. It's interesting. Because this is a Sapphire, dude. Sapphire is so dope. Um, yeah. So dope. <laughs> yeah, so what about... dope, man. So dope. Are you, are you interested in... <laughs> so you're not, in, you're not interested in, like, the... Uh, are you interested in, like, the Augur AK? No? Huh? Like me? Oh, Roboto. Oh. He's into skins now, I think. He's cool, yeah. He but the AK. Actually, yeah, I like the AK as well. I'd be interested, yeah. Yeesh. Roboto got, like, the really, best, like the the best cheap op that there is. Is that the one you bought? Did you buy the Aetherius? I traded that off. I just got a trade-up from it. Dude, that one, that's, it's, like, the best, like, cheap Look hard in his inventory. It looks pretty good. I'm looking. That's he got this. He got something juice. He got the smoke criminal. He got the stat track Glock 18 <laughs> off world. Uh, he's got the P90 Emerald Dragon. Uh, other than that, fucking Bruh. the dual Berettas, Royal. Bruh. 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 Skipping over it. Are you kidding me? I don't know. <laughs> Bro, an item in that inventory is literally 200 bucks. Let's cap. The Ziggy. <laughs> Yo, what does the P90 Emerald trade up to, bro? Oh. Medusa. Holy <laughs> shit. Yeah, Fire Serpent. Wait, is it 200 bucks? I, mean, I don't know. I made is that it? Up. Uh, no, man, it's like a pink. It's a what? For a P90? I guess. I guess. Yeah. The P90 is pretty good. <laughs> are you going to play the game or are you just like skin collecting now? I'm the, I'm the P90. No, he bought, uh, I got to get the Emerald I'm going to trade up for the Fire Serpy. Yeah. Wow. He's chasing his dream. <laughs> Ooh, this <laughs> one, Roboto. I've been told to buy a Bravo case. As Tom Cut told me yeah. it's a good investment in Cobblestones. Roboto, you need to buy this one actually for your collection. That's cool, but isn't that really isn't that like sixteen bucks or some shit? No, it's like eight quid for factory new. Oh, and that's pretty good. Yeah, it's it still has a show weapon, right? It's pretty nice. Yeah, it's terrible, but I use it now because of the skin. <laughs> <laughs> pay to play, Mister. What do you think though? Was it a good purchase? Ah. Uh... Uh, it will probably appreciate mm. if that's what you're talking about. But yes, I, it's probably a good investment. Uh, but if it's like for playing purposes, no. <laughs> it looks. I don't think it look. I don't think it looks that good. 
And also, it's on the P90. But maybe... Oh, it's a... Are you like a P90 yeah. connoisseur? You must be nationalist. <laughs> connoisseur. <laughs> <laughs> Do you, uh... I was going to buy the, uh... I was going to buy the Norwegian <laughs> one. I was going to buy the Norwegian <laughs> one, but it's too expensive. The Norwegian one? Yeah, it's like 200. What? The Norwegian the, uh, one? What the, are you Norse, the Norse collection, oh. the Astral Jormungar. I'm going to check. That's actually like 200, though. Is it a P90? It's not. It's not yeah, even I good though. It's work. only expensive because of the Medusa trade. Yeah. I work in like six hours. Yeah, dude. I'm not going to bed tomorrow if they call me. <laughs> they call me, I'm gonna just be like, Nah, I slept nah. three hours. Might be. Alright, I'll see you guys later though. Thanks for the conversation. Yeah, that was really fun. No yeah. worries. Later. Love you, brother. Bye. Love you too. Yeah. Mystic, you gotta help me. I don't know which <laughs> knife I should buy because I need to buy a knife for some reason. You need to? You, like, you have to? Shadow should I... St <sighs> should I... Because I like these gloves at the same time. I don't want to sell my knife. Yo, you know what I want? I want another loadout. I want a CT loadout. Wow. And a terrorist loadout. I think that's, that's smart. Big no. Big <laughs> I think that's kind of smart. Maybe, have the bet anyway, Maybe though, but, but like if hours. only if you have like fucking infinite cash, bro. Like, are you are you balling like that? Nah, nah. So then, <laughs> it's probably not. I think you should just be content with what you have. No. I mean, I'm balling, but yeah, it looks like good. That. I mean, I could, but should no. Have a good one, boys. Anyway, I'm gonna head to bed. Right. Yeah, yeah, peace. Later. Wait, why is the factory new? Oh, uh, P90 Astral fucking uh, Jormun Gadr. <laughs> why is it? Why is it worth less than the field tested one? I don't know. That's interesting. Maybe it's just on Yo, the market. Okay, okay. What about this combo? Huh? Alright. Huh? The slate. Oh. These gloves. Ooh, that's dope. Wid. 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 Yes. Uh, with the Bowie or the Talon. Uh. Oh, oh! I think that's gonna be. It. Oh my god! I think that's gonna go so hard. What the fuck? Yeah. I mean, it's a it's a common combo. Oh. Uh, uh. Apparently. Apparently. I think, yeah, I think that would yeah. go donkey dick hard. You know what I'm saying? Mm, uh, no, I don't. If you catch my drift. I do not. I do not. Do you perhaps float Dude, I want those cobalt skulls, dude. <laughs> I... No, you don't. Everything is Stop. the best. Stop. Everything is, is literally the best. You're fantasizing about... Or even the, even the well-worn looks good. This is basically well worn. True. Still tested though. Like what were the, what were the gloves you told me about? Moto gloves, blood pressure, right? Those are. Yeah, you actually need to, you actually need to get a ruby though for me. Like it's just so I could watch you play with a ruby and like. That would be dope. Red gloves. Also, I should probably stop the. Yo, why 